Hello, my amazing, beautiful, wonderful, fantastic friends. Welcome back to my channel. S the sirens are already going off. My gosh, it's never a dull day in Florida. We're just gonna have to work with it, but today I, I, can't, I can't work with it. It's so. Uh. One eternity later. Anyway, like I was saying, it is officially my first week of my last semester in undergrad. It's also just my first day of school, back to school after over a month off. And I honestly, I genuinely forgot I was a college student. I like remembered like a few days ago, I was like, oh my God. I have to go back to school, yikes. <laughs> so it's the first day back and I'm trying to get back into a routine. My semester is pretty light, thank God. I just have to take like last minute classes and things like that to complete my bachelor's of science. A lot of you guys always ask what I'm majoring in and I'm an allied health major with a concentration in physical therapy because I wanna to go to graduate school for physical therapy, so. That's the goal. And yeah, that's my major. I changed my major at the end of my junior year. So it is actually my fifth year in undergrad because I had so many classes to catch up on. I mean, I'm, I don't wanna say like, don't change your major at the end of junior year, meaning I did three years of college with a total of four years. So three out of the four years I did. And then I changed my major. I mean, I guess it's, you know, better late than never. But I decided to do a full day of eating, what I eat in a day, what I ate today type of video because you guys really enjoy those videos. And I do wanna do more like what I eat in a week as a vegan college student. So let me know, do you guys prefer what I eat in a day videos or what I eat in a week videos? Because I don't know. I don't mind filming either one, but just let me know in the comments below. But if you do end up enjoying this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up to let me know. But if you absolutely hated it, which I wouldn't blame you for, then you can give it a thumbs down because that's okay too. And of course, subscribe for more content by your certified damsel in distress. So I am actually on my way to my first class of the day, of the semester, of the week, and I'm feeling pretty good. I'm pretty happy with my schedule, but I am feeling really hungry. It's only like 9.30 in the morning, and I usually don't get hungry this early, but I'm really freaking hungry. And one of the worst feelings in the world is when you're in class and it's dead silent, and your stomach does that like noise, you know what I mean? It's not cute, it's embarrassing, I hate it. So I'm gonna bring like a little snack, and then it's my only class today, I only have one class today, which is great. So I'm gonna bring a snack, and then I'll have like a real breakfast once I get back home. These are like my best friend when I get back to school. I love this specific flavor of Go Macro Bars. It's the heartwarming retreat oatmeal chocolate chip. Love these. So I'm just gonna eat one of these on my way to class and then I will be back from having a real breakfast. So, see you guys then. Hello, my friends. I am back from school. Yes, I have already changed. It is freaking freezing outside. And that's not just me being, well, maybe it is. I, I was gonna say it's not just me being a Floridian, but it probably is. It's like 40 degrees, which for Florida, guys, it was like 90 degrees this weekend. So my body, it's, it's a shock. It's a shock to the body. And I went outside thinking like, I can handle it. No, no, it is so freaking cold outside. And I know I'm not alone because everyone on my campus, aside from the few people that went up north for their winter break, 40 degrees is nothing for them. 90% of my campus decked out in like sweaters and boots and jackets and sweats. So I'm not alone, but I'm finally back and I, got caught up scrolling through TikTok like I always do. Follow me on TikTok, please. <laughs> um, and it's already 12.30 and all I've had today is a Go Macro bar. So I'm gonna make myself some breakfast and I am feeling a nice warm bowl of oatmeal. I am like so excited to eat a bowl of oatmeal right now. It's gonna be good. I've shown how I make my oatmeal like a billion times before. I just make it on the stovetop because I think it tastes better on the stovetop. That's just me. But I'm gonna chop up an apple, put it in there while it's cooking so the apple gets nice and soft and delicious. Then I'm gonna add some frozen blueberries, uh, cashew milk, vanilla protein powder, and almond butter. As always, almond butter. So I'm gonna put that together. I'll see you guys when it's done. Okay, so this is my breakfast. I'm running low on almond butter. I was so sad. I opened it up and I thought I had a lot more, but I, I, my spoon hit the bottom and I was like, 
no. So I have like a very sad portion of almond butter right here, but it's okay. We'll make it work. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Oh my god, that's so good. So I'm gonna eat that. I'm gonna get started on some homework. Look at me. My main goal is to not procrastinate and to not trick myself into thinking like, oh, I just work better under pressure. Girl, shut up. <laughs> so I'm gonna get a head start on some schoolwork and stuff. Enjoy my oatmeal and then I'll be back when I'm having something else. I'm getting pretty hungry. So I'm gonna make myself some lunch and I'm going to be having a sandwich with some chips because it's like the lunch that I have every single day, pretty much. And it's because I don't want, I hate when bread goes bad. I absolutely hate it when I open up my bread and there's mold on it. And I'm like, damn, I just wasted like half a freaking loaf of bread. So I have sandwiches almost every single day. I have just this like the last two pieces of bread left. It's the butt of the bread, the end, the butt, I don't know. Everyone hates that bread. I love that piece of bread. I love the crust. I think it's great. So I'm gonna be having that and the other slice, of course. And I'm going to be having it with my favorite garlic hummus, the Cedars garlic hummus. Y'all already know what hummus I'm talking about. And I also have these game time buffalo chicken tenders from Dr. Prager's. I think they're really good. I really enjoy the taste of these. So I'm gonna be having, I think like four if it's on a piece of bread. So I'm gonna be having like four of these. And also going to be having one of these super greens veggie burgers by Dr. Prager's as well. And it has... Hi beans, quinoa, kale, Swiss chard, turnip greens, mustard greens, spinach, oil, potato flakes, onions. Apples? Apples, okay. Arrowroot powder, parsley, garlic, ginger, sea salt, black pepper, cayenne, blah, blah, blah. And that's gonna be my sandwich. That's been like my go-to sandwich lately. Really freaking good. I would recommend it. But um, my chips, I've never had these chips and I'm going to try them on camera for you guys. So I thought they looked intriguing and I am a sucker. Whenever I find barbecue chips that are vegan, I have to buy them. Like I have to, it's not a choice because barbecue chips are my personal favorite chip flavor. Barbecue chips and sea salt and vinegar chips. I love sea salt and vinegar, but I can't have a lot of them. You know what I mean? Cause then it like burns your mouth. But these are quinoa chips. They are good. You can tell, they're like in between a real chip and a pop chip. They're really good though. Mm. Sandwich, chips, I'll put that together. See you guys when it's done. What's a BTS song or like any song? Doesn't have to be BTS, you know? Any song. What is the song that you can just always listen to no matter what kind of mood you're in? Whether you're happy, you're sad, you're mad, whatever you are. What song can you always listen to? Mine is Euphoria and Serendipity. I can listen to those songs no matter what and they will put me in a good mood. Even if I'm already, even if I'm already in a good mood, they'll put me in an even better one. All day, every day. <laughs> Another song that I could always listen to, Grow Up by Stray Kids. Mm. Kind of makes me cry, <laughs> so I might start crying. It isn't really a Diana video if I don't have a little K-pop jam out sesh. I gotta do it, it's my brand now. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I, just having a jam out sesh by yourself in your kitchen and just going all out, having a good time, feeling yourself, 
It makes your day so much better. Honestly, if you're having a bad day, put on your favorite song and just dance. Just dance like nobody's watching you because guess what? No one is. Just let yourself have a good time. Let yourself feel, feel so freaking good. Okay, I'm gonna actually put this together and I will be back. Okay. Can I not do the peace sign every single time I do a transition? Why, is, why do I have to do that? Why am I compelled to do that? I don't know. All right. Cool. Y'all can see that. Yeah, y'all can see that. Hummus. First, this is the hummus that I was talking about. It's Cedars garlic hummus. I put this on almost everything. <laughs> Boom. This green veggie patty is really mushy. Like, no matter how long I cook it, it's pretty mushy. That's why I like to use it as a topping, like with other stuff. Like, I don't think I would ever just eat it alone. I can assure you, it's not gonna look that on the inside, but that's okay. I can assure you, it's not gonna look that cute once I, you know, reveal her. In the end, what matters is the personality. That is what she looks like. You know, she's trying her best. Taste is what matters. Taste is what matters. And she's gonna taste phenomenal. She's trying. Is she succeeding? She's trying. But oh man, does she taste fire. This has been my go-to sandwich lately. It's so good. And it's so easy. Mm. I'm gonna eat my sandwich, eat these chips. I'll probably have like, I don't know. I'll just have them until I don't want them anymore. <laughs> hey guys. So I finished this bag of chips and it was a lot more filling than I thought it would be. I'm really full, but the lighting is leaving us and I want to end this video before the lighting is completely gone. I'm going to make myself some dinner. I don't know what happens. I don't know what happened to it, but I ate this bag of chips. So I think what I'm gonna do for dinner is I'm just gonna have something light. I'm just gonna make some vegetables, like pan fry some vegetables and have some tofu with it because I'm just not super hungry right now. So I have a nice light dinner. Still got room for dessert though. I'm still gonna have some chocolate or something after dinner. But as for dinner, like I planned on having noodles for dinner, but that's not happening. <laughs> that is just, no. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna make some vegetables, some tofu, it's gonna be good. Whenever I get like the hallway in the frame, I'm always like, ooh, that looks creepy. I'm gonna be going to edit and I'm gonna see something that shouldn't be there. And I'm not looking forward to that. So the lighting is so terrible. I'm so sorry. But here is my dinner. It looks very plain. I realize that, but it's gonna be delicious. I promise. But this smells divine. It smells exquisite. So I've got some broccoli, some zucchini, some shiitake mushrooms and a bunch of kimchi, as you guys can see, and then like half a block of tofu that I just seasoned with soy sauce, salt, and pepper. And then I cooked the vegetables in sesame oil because it adds so much flavor. Yeah, and then I seasoned the vegetables with the same stuff, just salt, pepper, soy sauce, because the kimchi already adds like a lot of flavor, in my opinion, and the sesame oil, so good. So this is gonna be my dinner. I'm gonna eat that, and then I will be back when I'm having some dessert. Yeah, thumbs up instead of a peace sign, switching it up. <laughs> Oh dear, <laughs> it's getting late, which as you can see by my disgusting makeup, it is getting late. I say late and it's like 8 p.m. But I'm gonna have myself some dessert because I want something sweet to end the night. I always want something sweet to end the night. And I'm going to be having this Hue chocolate bar. This is my favorite chocolate brand. It is kind of pricey. I. I know I shouldn't buy it that much, but it's so good. Like, I love this chocolate so much. It's a luxury item for me. You know what I mean? It's like, if I want to be fancy, if I'm trying to be like bougie, I get this chocolate. And this is the flavor cashew butter and raspberry jelly, which is delicious. I love this. So I think I'm just gonna have like half of this. Can you see anything inside? No, not really. Mm-hmm. The jelly is like not too strong. It's just like this nice tart flavor. I'm gonna eat that which means that is the end of this video I hope you guys enjoyed it Please make sure to give a thumbs up to let me know that you did But if you absolutely hated it, you can give it a thumbs down because that's okay, too Comment anything else you would like to see on my channel and subscribe for more content by yours truly If you haven't already heard it today, you are amazing. You're beautiful. You're wonderful You are so so valid and I love you and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!